Good morning and welcome to Prayer and Coffee. Sunday was 37 years as pastor at Community Haven. And by the grace of God, I am what I am and where I am. The grace of God has been with me. And I've been praying into the promises, the prophetic words given to me, uh, to our church, and I've felt God's presence. I've also felt the resistance from the enemy. I've never felt stronger and I've never felt weaker. I've never felt more confident and I've never felt more helpless. I know that God is up to something and it's not just at our church. Christ also loved the church and gave himself for her that he might sanctify and cleanse her with the washing of water by the word that he might present her to himself a glorious church. I believe Christ is sanctifying and cleansing his church right now. God told Jeremiah, I am watching over my word to perform it. I believe Jesus is watching over his word for his church. Let's pray. Father, this generation needs to see the church your son Jesus is still building and empowering a glorious church. So we pray again from Acts 4. Now, Lord, look on all that is happening in this generation and grant to your servants that with all boldness they may speak your word by stretching out your hand to heal and that signs and wonders may be done through the name of your holy servant Jesus. And Lord, when we pray, let the place where we assemble together be shaken and let us all be filled with the Holy Spirit and speak the word of God with boldness. Father, let every prophetic word, every promise spoken to Cindy and I and to Community Haven be fulfilled now. In the name of your Holy Son, Jesus.